today we're going to start this fucking YouTube channel. Getting that fresh brood. Alright, so I'm over here at the local U-Pull. And uh, I'm trying to get this rear end out, this Dodge Ram 1500. Um, the guys, when they set the truck up, they didn't put it on the stands right. Yesterday I was here, I tried pulling it out and the truck almost fell over on me. So I came back today, this morning, and I did get all the bolts out except for one of the rear end. Uh, but I gotta wait, I'm sitting over here, it's pouring out, I'm gonna check it out. And that's it right there. She's gonna be coming out soon. All right, so once I get this out, uh, or once the guy gets over here, well, I'll show you what he does. Watch him move the truck over. All right. Stop right there. Alright, so I got it out. Got it all disconnected. Um, here they tell you to pull it out into the aisle and then they come by with the forklift and pick it up. You gotta cut a seat belt out, strap a seat belt on it, this way they can lift it. Yeah, that's it. Alright, so pretty much on my way. Oh crappy day. I mean, I probably picked the worst day to come here to pull this rear, but uh, places like this, it's first come, first serve. So, I mean, if you don't get your, your ass over here and get it, it could be gone. So, um, as soon as it came up on the website, I shot right over here. Great thing about this place, they uh, rent you out golf carts. So, I mean, used to I used to walk around this thing. Oh, it was horrible uh, walking through here. Oh, well, like yesterday I actually walked to uh, try to, you know, look look at it and make sure the uh, the gear ratio is right. I pulled the VIN, I did a VIN check just to make sure the gear's right in the rear. Everything seems to be well. All right, so yeah, heading back up. Um, gonna pay for everything and then I'm out of here. All right, finally, I'm picking my rear end up. I'm gonna load her in. One cool thing when I was here, I found this awesome sports bumper for my pickup. Look at that. Rare find. Great find.
All right, she's finally in the back. Time to head home. Just gotta wait for that tow truck to get out of my way, and then I'll be on my way. Holy fucking bananas, man. Holy shit. I just sat there and waited for like 20, 30 minutes just to get out the yard because of a tow truck sitting in front of me trying to bring some cars in. Oi. But either way, all at ease, on the way. This guy just left too. He was behind me. All right, just got back. Uh, let me get this bumper out of here and I'll, you guys can check it out. All right, cool. So I got my uh, windshield wiper motor and uh, transmission, I guess you'd call it, or some people call it. And then I got my fuse box, or tip them. So, and the rear. All right, so there she is. That is nice. That is going to set the truck off nice. Oh, yeah. That's $33.95 I spent all week. All right, here we go. We're gonna uh, put the rear in, and that's it. So these uh, any kind of rusty bolt ends that are sticking out, like these U-bolts, I'll always uh, clean the rust out from them. So that's less likely to strip. Let me spray a little lubricant on there. Leverage gets it. At least got it spinning. That's a good thing. Where you going, Precious? Huh? Where you going? You were supposed to put that rear in. Where were you? We said you were going to take it out. You didn't take it out. How bad did it? No, I don't sniff that. That's broken glass.
right, here we go again.